everyone welcome back to my channel so today I'm going to be doing a review on the new makeup revolution um, fast face foundation and packaging as you guys can see it's really pretty it's um, baby pink it's not baby pink but it's cream nude with a hint of pink in it and it's really really nice the packaging as you guys can see it's got this rose gold detailing as well and yeah so the packaging looks like that I've got mine in the shade F8 um, let's see if this zooms yeah I've got it in F8 and once you open it this is what it looks like it's got like rose gold detailing on the um, inside the packaging and then when you twist it up it's like that it's retailing for five pound at the moment and um, uh, how many grams is in there it doesn't say so what I'm going to do is get my phone and look online and let you guys know all the claim we have okay so it comes in 18 shades um, it's obviously for F1 to F6 is for lighter skin tone and then F7 to F12 is medium skin tone and F13 to F18 is for darker skin tone which is a really good you know sh shade range to have considering the fact that they just came out with it so you know I'm glad they catering for every single skin tone and you know I, I like the fact that they've got like really really light shade which is you can see here to the deepest darker shade which is there you know and they are um, catering for all different undertones like warm tone, neutral, cool tone when you go on the website you can see it gives you the full guideline and then it just says this foundation goes fast um, this foundation just got faster it says fast face foundation quick, uh, quickly um, perfects, contours and highlights your uh, complexion so uh, my sister has the shade 13 and um, I'm going to, I was going to show Oh my god, I'm so unwell. I don't know what I'm saying. Um, I was going to bronze my skin with it, but it's in the. Um, I'll get it out later. So, anyways, what I'm going to do is I'm going to. Sh before that, let me. Guys, if I'm all over the place, if I'm looking down, if I'm like. I don't know what I'm doing. It's because I'm really just out of it. And um, I have to film quite. A f I want to film at least three, four videos. Don't even ask. Um. So with this one, I, I'm fully aware it's almost 5 o'clock and uh, I'm filming now because all morning I was feeling sick. I've been vomiting. Don't even ask you guys. And um, so, you know, um, I won't be keeping this foundation for way too long. But I think I'll probably keep it to like 11 or something or 12, I'll see. Um, so you guys can see. I know they don't claim it to be like, you know, long lasting or anything like that. So, um... I just want to come on here and show you guys how fast it is, like the um, name suggests, fast base. So I just want to um, show you guys. By the way, you know I still can't find my concealer shade. I'm in shade C6. It's still out of stock. Still in no stores. By the way, it's raining outside. It's pouring. It's like I said, it's 5 o'clock. A window shut. Cur curtain shut. I'm using my ring light. Oh, London weather, you guys. But anyways, what I'm going to do is get myself you guys won't believe I have this massive thing here as um because I moved some of the things from my background um but yeah anyways um I've got that big mirror but I'm not gonna use that one I'm going to use a different mirror let me get myself a mirror as well I'm so unorganized okay yeah, I hope this is big enough for my fat base hold on yep that's fine so what I'm going to do is I'm not sure how much I'm, I need to go in, uh, how much I need to apply and stuff. So I'm going to go light hand first. Oh, this is really creamy. Um, so on my last foundation video, I was telling you guys, right, how I'm always struggling to find a shade. Whereas my sister, on the other hand, she'll be online and she'll match, uh, she'll, you know, match her shade and stuff all online. And I'm that person, I'm like forever struggling to even figure out what shade I am and stuff so she chose this shade for me and she's 100% convinced that this is the right shade and I think yeah by the way I'm gonna look like a ghost because of the ring light but this color in person yeah okay 
Let me ask. I'm not it. sure. I don't think they claim to be full coverage or anything. But uh, mine's going on really light. Um, another thing, guys. Yeah, obviously, because I'm always I always use a beauty blender or some kind of some kind of sponge. I don't use a brush. I know when you use a brush, um, when you use a brush to apply foundation, of course the um, it goes on a lot more. Um, what is it? Um, it would be a lot more full coverage compared to the sponge because they tend to obviously take off some of the products. But you know what? I like I said, and it's going to be a broken record on this channel that I would rather have light to medium coverage and then go in with additional product than to be full coverage. Saying that, I did love my Maybelline um, 24 hour one and that one is beautiful but then again when I put that one on I don't use that much face powder or nothing but this is what one layer looks like, the first layer looks like and uh, I'm not mad at it, um, as I was saying this is the first layer and I'm not mad at it or anything I'm going to go in with the second layer to see if this is buildable So as you guys can see, the second layer I went a bit, um, I went a bit um, heavy on that one because I think the first layer I applied way too less, and I think my beauty blender, my beauty sponge, um, is obviously soaking up um, some product, but that's fine. This layer is actually perfect for me. This kind of coverage because that's how I like it. Um, overall, obviously, I've heard um, really good things about the foundation, whether it's on videos or on Instagram or anything like that. And um, yeah, it's actually a pretty good foundation. So this is what it looks like. I look so light on camera. It's not good. Must, and it's not matching with my neck, but here it's fine. So, and it did just this light, I think. But yeah, anyways, this is what it look. Um, this is what it's looking like. Um, it's a little dewy, making my. It's not dry. Um, this smile line of mine. It's a problem, but it's not the foundation's fault. But yeah, I like the fact that it's a little dewy and it's not completely matte or flat out. Uh, like when I move my face, you can see like it is catching light. Um, so what I'm going to do is do my full face and. Um, show you guys what the final product looks like and I, because I'm going to be filming other films I sound so <laughs> because I'm going to be filming um, other videos so I probably will check in once or twice considering how long I keep it on for and how good or bad I feel throughout the next couple of hours but yeah this is what it's looking like so far let me just go quickly go and do the rest of my face and then I'll come back and show you guys the final product so you guys it's been about over an hour now of me having this um, of um, me applying the foundation and obviously I went ahead and did all the bronzing and the full makeup and everything like that and it's been over an hour um, and um, this is what it's looking like so basically initial thought is that because of my skin at the moment because I'm not well and obviously my skin is playing up with me maybe that's why um, I didn't initially instantly like what it looked what what it looked like on my skin but now that it's been sitting here for about an hour now i kind of am enjoying it i did like the coverage like i said it's not full coverage or anything and i like that kind of look um and i've used this highlighter which um at first i thought it was um showing my pores and stuff way too much but actually it's not so yeah this is what it's looking like after an hour of me putting it on and so far so good so what i'm going to do is i'm going to come back and show you guys obviously a check-in so anyways this is what it's looking like so far and i'm enjoying it and i'll let you guys know what it's what it's looking like in about a couple of hours time also you guys when i first started talking my again my mic wasn't on so maybe that's why the voice is going to be a bit funny compared to before to now i always forget to put my mic on it's just silly of me but yeah i will keep it on for 
the next part of the rest of hey the you video. guys so this is the last and final check-in for the makeup revolution um foundation um stick the fast base stick um i'm so sorry you guys that i'm like really down in this video and like i'm not really doing like my usual check-in i'm really like feeling really unwell right now i literally called out of our service and stuff so i'm waiting for them to call me because my this eye feels like it's closing and there's some like i've got such a bad headache so i really want to just get out of the makeup and stuff so um but i did have it on for like fairly four hours over four hours now and yeah the foundation is like doing really well and you know what it is guys i feel like i've not been fair to the product because i've tried it on a day where i'm feeling so awful and my skin and everything feels like you know i'm feeling really bad within me you know like um i'm just thinking if this foundation performed this well while my skin and me feeling this so bad like you know i, I know my skin is at is worse today because of the fact that i didn't have enough sleep for the last two days and you know whatnot so i will wear it on other days where obviously i'm feeling a lot better when i'm going back to work and things like that where i'm i'm sure the foundation will be even better if like i said if it's looking this great while my skin is playing up with me due to illness imagine how it would be like when i am actually fine and my skin's looking like feeling its best so overall my views are like you know for five pound you really can't go wrong so like i said this is the shade that i have for me right which i forgot to do a hand swatch and everything for you guys i'm really sorry but this is what it looks like on my hand and i've got my sister shade here which again i was supposed to bronze with but i don't know i completely forgot and i just went in but like you guys can see there right um it this this color it's beautiful so you know these are the two shades that's mine and that's my sister's and um i will do maybe another tutorial using it um on camera or something just so that you guys i give the product a fair shot i feel like i've been really unfair to it today because you know i'm i don't know because i'm not feeling so great i was supposed to film two more videos like a perfume collection video and um my single makeup revolution eyeshadow singles but i really can't i just want to get out of this makeup and everything and maybe i'm gonna go to go doctors or hospital because i'm really feeling so unwell so anyways you guys i'm really sorry that i'm sounding so bad and i'm like my energy is so low um but i hope you guys enjoyed watching this video i honestly you guys for five pound makeup revolution killed it i've heard the foundation and um, the concealer is really really good so um i really can't wait to get the concealer it's just unfortunate that i can never find my shade doing this great on a skin that's ill on a person that's ill and feeling so bad um skin that's ill <laughs> um then imagine how it would be like when you know on a good healthy day um so anyways you guys i'm gonna sign off i feel like i'm blabbing on and i'm going on and police cars ambulance typical stigata video um Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. And I'll see you guys next video when I'm feeling a lot better. I filmed three videos today feeling like this. I'm not filming anymore until I get better because I'm, I really can't concentrate with that light. I really can't. So anyways, I'll take care of you guys. Bye.